Hey everybody, it's Ben, and you know, winter is approaching. We're here in early December, and uh, there's some things that you need to take care of on your boat just to make sure that your boat is ready and you're not going to have any issues when the temperatures drop below freezing. So, I'm here in Texas. Luckily, I can fish throughout the year, but there are still days where it will drop below freezing, and there's some things that need to take care of. So, if you're up north, you may have already put your boat away for the season, or you're getting ready to very soon. So, here's a couple of things that I do that I encourage you to take a look at on yours to get ready. Okay, the first thing I want to check as I'm getting my boat ready for winter is I want to go through every compartment on my boat just to make sure that there's not going to be any water anywhere in the boat. So don't leave water sitting. Uh, take a towel, dry it up. And then speaking of towels, if you find any wet towels that are laying around in your boat as you're going through all of your compartments, take them out, take them home, wash them, uh, but don't leave them sitting in the boat wet. It's going to mildew, stink. Uh, you're not going to enjoy it. So make sure everything's dry. All right, as I'm also going through my compartments, I'm gonna check my rod lockers. I'm gonna go through each of my fishing poles and I'm gonna to check to make sure that the uh, line guides are not bent or broken or missing any of the ceramic inserts. And then I'm also looking to see if I need to re-spool any of my lines. And then the last thing I'm gonna do with those is I'm going to lubricate my reels just to make sure that they are ready to go uh, next year. After that, I'm gonna go through all of my tackle I'm going to check to see if there's anything that I'm out of or running low on that I need to reorder. That way, again, I am going to be ready for when the next season starts. Uh, you have everything there, so don't wait last minute. Just go through and check it, inventory it, see if there's something that you want to replace. Don't forget to check all your live wells. Again, make sure they are clean and dry. Check your bilge especially. If you have an anchor line on board, make sure that it is dry. A lot of times where they sit up in the bow, uh, they'll get a lot of spray that goes into that compartment. So again, pull it out, make sure it's not molded, mildewed, and uh, just let it air out and dry. If you have a washdown system, um, raw water or fresh water, you, you want to make sure that's completely uh, empty, drained. Uh, you don't want it to freeze and then bust. So last year, I forgot to uh, drain my raw water system. And all, to drain it, all I had to do was turn on the switch and let it empty out of the hose. Well, I forgot last year, we dropped below freezing, and then the little plastic filter cap, uh, there was a little water in there, so that expanded when it froze and it broke. So it cost me about $12 to replace it, and it only took a couple of minutes, but I could have saved myself time and money had I uh, made sure it was drained properly. All right, everybody, hopefully you found this information useful. And uh, doing these few items prior to you putting your boat away for the season is going to end up saving yourself some time and heartache in the long run. So y'all stay safe and stay warm.